What's good everybody, it's your boy Robin, I'm back with another video. Hey, uh, this video is kinda, kinda like a little bit of a shout out to my homeboy BG Tech Life, who really got me interested in trying out some of these Android betas for my Pixel 7. He been doing a lot of uh, Android beta videos, so I'm excited to get in on this. So. Um, so what's good techie <laughs> I downloaded Android beta 14 5.3 uh, the beta uh, to see what it was like uh, good like I said a good friend of mine BG tech life seemed to be enjoying these Android 14 so much that I wanted to see what all the hype was up and with the short time with this beta all I can say is Google has a winning formula on their hands now let's start with the look. Now when you think Android couldn't get more minimal, <laughs> leave it up to Google to find a way. The fonts are nice and clean, uh, make, making everything uh, really easy to read off the like paper-like white background. So with notification bar looking better and more defined, everything in this particular beta looks, looks much cleaner, has a much cleaner look to it. So that's a plus going in uh, from a software standpoint Android 14 offers a very easy to use user interface but some of the different settings have been moved around like uh, for example the keyboard and navigation settings being moved to the system settings may take some time to get it uh, a little adjusted to so it may take a little time a little bit more time to figure out where a lot of your favorite settings may be located the camera is where I'm hoping to see the most improvements, especially with video. Now the camera UI looks great. Uh, it feels much easier to maneuver and, and the new minimal look also continues over into the camera UI setup. Now I'm not going to give you a final verdict on how uh, good the cameras are while Android 14 beta is still being used. Uh, it wouldn't be a fair thing to do so let's hold out some hope that at least uh, on the video side of things things will greatly improve now the pixel launcher now that it, it is very easy to use but offers very little in options when it comes to customization outside of google's own interpretation of this material look now it's kind of bland the app the color combinations the field of customization all feel somewhat bland so anything flashy will literally require you to download a third-party launcher and some icon pack just to make things a little bit more you know fancy so in conclusion um everything is all and well with google and android 14. Uh, the beta seems to be very stable but with all betas betas i recommend anyone proceeding with caution especially if the phone is the one you you have is your main phone now if you have another phone and you have uh, uh, any type of a uh, pixel phone just sitting in your drawer by all means try it out see if you like it but for sure do not use this on your main phone you know betas can cause issues with uh, some phones and how it functions so just wait for the stable version if your pixel phone is your main phone so that does it with my first impressions of the Android 14 beta 5.3. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to get, uh, hit the notification bell, smash that subscribe button. And for more videos like this one, be on the lookout. And again, everybody stay techie and I catch you in the next video. I'm out.